Welcome back guys. It's been quite a while since I've made my last video so I decided it was time for at least a little system update. So it's the 26th of the month. It's time for a monthly test and tonight I am joined by the last team standing and we're going to do a remote test of the system. So what I've set up here is uh, a remote uh, com port server. So this panel can be controlled pretty much from anywhere in the world. Um, so now maybe if you test, just let me double check that it's on test. Yeah, so maybe if you test one of the devices in my sleep out, maybe the beam detector. Alrighty. We should be able to see him go through the menu. Sorry, I exited it there. Uh, next one. Oh yeah, that's my smoke detector. Alright. It's device two. Yeah, that one. Okay, that's gone red. And now it should go into fire. Should do. Did you do it twice? Oh no, there we go. Yeah. Okay. So maybe quickly let silence alarms off. Oh, you reset it again. Alright, we'll just go to the next one. Yeah. Oh, not master bedroom because that's going to set the alarms off inside. Just go uh, device um, 20. Device, tw see what device 20 is. It's 13. It's too high. Not that one, not that one. That one, that's gonna set the alarms off straight away. So, right, so, so quick, so. quickly test it, and then once it's in fire, turn silence off until you hear the siren, and then back on. Scary stuff. It's weird not controlling it. Okay, that's about to send a fire signal. Wow, that was loud. Okay. That was super weird. <laughs> not been controlling it. Okay, so I'm gonna... Uh, once you've gone out of all the menus, I'll take it off test. So it should be back to normal. Off test. And silence alarms off. Okay, this is just a short update video. A complete remote test using this box here. Hope you enjoyed watching and see you next time.